for the first time in 25 years, direct flights have resumed between Singapore and the Pacific island of New Caledonia, just shy of 1,500 kilometers from Brisbane. After a nine-hour flight from Singapore, we embarked on a five-day adventure to discover the paradise that is this French territory. To experience a wealth of natural beauty, you can take a three-hour outrigger tour to the Isle of Pines. Along the way, you can admire the natural rock formations rising from the water. On the island, a wander through the lush forest leads you to the natural pool of Oro Bay. The Domain de Diva is an outdoor playground where you can hike, cycle and ride horses. Or, if you prefer to take it easier, have a picnic and enjoy the breeze. New Caledonia also has luxury in five-star hotels, the perfect place to relax after exploring the great outdoors. Or you can book a homestay with the Canucks, New Caledonia's indigenous people, and learn about their way of life. You can even try bukna, a Canuck dish that can consist of taro, sweet potato, yam and local meat, all cooked in coconut milk. The capital city of New Caledonia, Numia is full of museums, art galleries and farmers markets. Plus de Cocotier is a fresh produce paradise. It's also a great place to shop for handcrafted jewellery and to get to know the locals. New Caledonia's Aquarium de Lagoon was the first in the world to present fluorescent corals back in 1958. A place of conservation, you can also watch rescued turtles recuperating in their pool. Whether you are drawn by the call of the wild or looking for a haven of calm, New Caledonia is perfect for your next escape.